Hey, what's going on YouTube? It's Nick from Noob Kill coming at you with another video today. Welcome to my vlog to the EA Sports um, headquarters down in San Francisco. Like I said, it's, we're going down to EA Sports. So I want to give a huge shout out and a big thank you to EA Sports for sponsoring this whole trip. Uh, but yeah, guys, it's going to be a lot of fun. Let's go ahead and go to the airport, all right? day but I had to get some footage of I guess the highway and stuff but uh, for sure catch you guys at the hotel all right all right guys it's good to be back in the soul hotel man it is so nice I, I can't I can't, I can't believe I forgot how nice it was here um, little quick tour here's the bathroom very very nice bathroom right there showers all nice uh, all that good stuff um, but yeah let's go ahead and check out the room look how I I miss this place, man. I got myself a king size bed, boys. We got a king size bed. Let's go. Of course, we got the TV. Um, we got a table here. Big, a lot of space, actually, since it's not like a two queen type of room. Just one king. But this is one of the best parts of the room, man. Look at the view. Look at the view. Look at that, man. We got the pool there. I brought my swim trunk, so I might even be going swimming. The weather looks awesome, guys. Uh, we got, I don't know, can't really say this is the bay. We just got some type of lake that, uh, outside. Um, so yeah, guys, that is the hotel room. Um, I believe the guys are already downstairs, so um, I'm gonna go ahead and go ahead and meet them, meet some of the guys. Um, I know like Stop D, Uber YouTuber are coming down here, so that's been pretty cool meeting them. I know my boy Kralo's already here, Cornell's here as well, um, Danny Doberlin, you guys know him as well. So I'm gonna go ahead and chill out. We're gonna call probably this the night for today and some other crazy stuff happens. I have no idea, but yeah guys, that was the first part of the day. Most of it was just travel. I, I was kind of cheesed that. Um, it was so long and then we got stuck at the gate for 30 minutes because they couldn't open the door and then of course I had a there's a hotel shuttle um, for us at the airport but I don't know something happened to the shuttle and then I had to take another I had to take a cab and all that stuff so I was like running around the airport for like no reason um, but that being said guys uh, we made it we made it safe can't really complain too much about that so I'm happy to be here and yeah guys um, if anything else happens I'll record it but probably catch you tomorrow we're gonna go to the studio tomorrow so that's the fun part all right guys, so day two of the trip, man, the weather is just, it's just so nice, man. Like it's, I think it's 61 degrees Fahrenheit, 50, I think 17 actually degrees Celsius. And I think your boy, he's gonna test it out and wear some shorts. I don't know if that's a mistake. I haven't been outside yet. Just looks so nice. And the weather is just, just looks nice as well. But yeah, guys, I'm gonna be going down to the campus. I'm meeting a friend for lunch. Um, it's gonna be a lot of fun. Um, and I'm going with my boy Kralo as well. So I got to meet him downstairs. We got to get the shoes on and then afterwards uh, head downstairs and I'll kind of take you guys on the walk um, to the EA campus, all right? Cause it's not too far away from the hotel. Guys, so it looks like we found a wild Kralo. 
if you guys can see that. I can't zoom in with the GoPro, but there he is. He said it's cold. Look at him. He's wearing a sweater. He's wearing, he's wearing pants. Yo, the weather is the weather is lit outside. I don't know why he's saying it's cold. There he is on the phone though. <laughs> How cool is that, guys? Man, I'm back in the. I'm back. It's good to be back. The front changed a lot. I'll try to show you guys in the beginning on the front there, but this is sick, man. So many of the statues. I was looking on the arcade. Arcade is pretty dope. It has like all the. All the cool stuff. Battle. Good. How cool is that, guys? How cool is that? Put 17 there. So yeah, they changed the front. If you guys remember the first time I was here, this was actually where the front desk was. Now the front desk is over there. But look how cool that is. So. <laughs> yeah, look how sick that is. It's moving and stuff. All that respawn, and then look at that. Man, this place is so nice. This is one. If you guys remember back to the first vlog I did here, I don't know if you guys watched it, but there's like three parts of the campus, um, and this is just the entrance one. I think this is the main hub. Um, but man, is it nice? All right, guys, so you guys are probably thinking like, noob, you look like an idiot. Your voice is not matching up what you're saying right now. And that's because, yo, guys, I had my, um, I guess my GoPro and my mic plugged into my GoPro and I put in my bag and I guess the movement in the bag, it snapped my microphone um, and now the microphone wasn't working. So I had it plugged in. It looked like everything was good to go. Uh, but then I looked at the recording and I'm like, it didn't record any sound so i apologize for that guys uh what happened what happened now actually so you saw we were at the ea headquarters afterwards we got dinner and we met up with all the other game changers and they gave us our game changer box present so that was pretty sick um it's pretty sweet that it's like a nice game changer box let's go ahead and open up this bad boy and see what's inside so it says ea sports game changers right there and inside it looks like we got another elgato hd60 game capture card right there guys we got a little box i'll open that in a second um and then also lastly in the box we do get a nice EA Sports Game Changer t-shirt. Now, this was a little hard, difficult doing this with one hand, and this was my off hand, my uh, left hand, but there it says Game Changer University, um, so that's pretty cool. Um, but that is one thing, and then this little bad boy in this little white box, what it's all about. Like I said, this was a little difficult doing this with my um, non-dominant hand, but we got it open, we got it all out, and here it is. So we got a little cable right there, and then in this little, like, bubble wrap little bag, um, it is actually a battery pack for, and it says EA Sports Game Changers on that as well. And what's so cool is, like, yo, we're at a mobile event, they know our batteries are going to die playing these mobile games, so we got some juice on them, and I believe this pa battery pack has, what, here, or 2,000 milliamps, sorry. Um, so it's a little smaller battery pack. Mine is a 20,000 milliamp battery pack, a lot bigger, but... It's really nice we got one of those, but here it goes again, me looking like an idiot and my voice is not syncing up talking to the camera. Uh, but pretty much, guys, um, that was about it about this night. We went ahead and um, did got dinner. I was going to try to time lapse for you guys the sunset in the room, but I couldn't get that to happen because we I was in my room when the sun was setting. Um, but yeah, guys, enough talk. Let's move on to the next day, all right? All right, guys, so it looks like some of the people guys are down here. Got Look at this guy. Look at this guy. Oh, hey, what's up, guys? How you doing? Know, I'm like in every video. <laughs> like, hey, what's going on? We got Stop D here, Uber, Uber YouTuber. Got the FIFA guys right here, here as well. Yeah, guys, so we're just waiting for more people to calm down, I guess. And then we're going to get breakfast, and then we're going to go do the tour and the whole game changers. Like, all that good stuff I've been telling you guys about, we're finally doing it, right? Like, <laughs> um, so yeah, guys, we're going to wait for more people to calm down, and I'll kind of get you guys on the walk and everything. Alright guys, so we're heading in. I have no idea how the audio is because my mic broke, so if it doesn't look good, I'm going to voice over everything. Um, but we're walking in like, look at that. You guys remember being here? You watched that video like two years ago? <laughs> walking in once again. Do you want to go through this main doors? Sure, why not? Does it work? Can we go through? all the 
So y'all were here yesterday. Y'all already know this. You already know this. We got Dragon Age over here. Front desk. Okay, we got the room. Look at it. We got FIFA mobile banners, NBA Live, Madden Mobile, all that good stuff. And I lost. I don't have a chair now. <laughs> oh yeah, look at that. Who's over there? Cornell's trying to be a teacher. He's trying to be a leader over here. Look at that. He's dope. Okay, what's that all about? Alright guys, so we're in the Galaxy of Heroes and Real Racing and Need for Speed. This is pretty cool. Got the developers in here. Same thing on the TV here. Um, yeah guys, it's pretty sick. Every room is kind of decked out for each theme. I know Plants vs Zombies just came worldwide like a couple days ago. Um, it's actually been soft launched in Canada for a while now, but it's out. But I like these little rooms. Everybody has like a little you play the game and stuff, but yeah. What's going on guys? We're back at the airport. Um, I apologize to you guys that I didn't really vlog too much at the EA campus. Um, kind of just busy talking to like the developers and all that good stuff, but um, give them all your feedback guys. I'm getting some nice time lapse shots at the airport. Um, I know the vlog has been a little hit or miss um, here and there. I wanted to get some good time lapse shots at the Toronto Pearson Airport, but where I was sitting, there was no one at the airport and then the hotel. Um, wanted to get like that cool view and like a time lapse of the of the view like sun setting and stuff like that but and everything was so calm that really it was just like basically taking a still photo it was like no point of me time lapsing anything so um, luckily here the airport's a little more busier um, and I'm getting some nice time lapse right there of the airplane taking off landing and all that good stuff but I'll catch you guys probably when we're back at home all right Alright guys, so we are back home, we made it back safe and sound, so I'm really happy about that, but man, that flight, that flight was insane because, yo, what happened was, it was like already delayed like 5 minutes, and then we got all got loaded, like 5 minutes wasn't a big deal at all, like we are like, okay, that's not a problem, um, but we all got loaded onto the plane, everybody's sitting, um, and the next thing you know, the cap, um, the captain, or the pilot, I should say, captain, um, the pilot of the plane, um, jumps on the PA system and is like, hello folks, um, uh, one of the tires popped or something like that um the maintenance crew is here and it's gonna take about an hour um estimated to fix that and then they're gonna take another 20 minutes to do their pre-check um so i was just like another hour and a half delay and he's like hope uh, thankfully we are going with the wind so we can shave off some time there but we're probably gonna be delayed probably 20 minutes and then that delay um turned into a whole hour of course and we made up a little bit of time but then right when we got in near toronto um there's a storm happening in toronto like it was raining pretty bad i guess and the guy gets on the pa system again and he's like um it looks like there's gonna be a storm and it went from i was looking on the screen like the um air sh 
show on the time like see when I was gonna land back home because my parents were waiting for me and I didn't want to make them wait too long right um, and it said like 11 minutes and then the guy jumps on the thing and he's like yo uh, we're gonna have to take another detour it's gonna take us another 30 minutes to get down uh, to get touchdown and yeah I'm like wow so we've just been sitting in this plane that we're only supposed to be in there for about like four and a half and we we're in there for another six hours so I was just like uh, I was just a little mad about that, but I couldn't complain. I made it back home. Uh, thank you to EA for paying the way for my trip all the way down to the Redwood and EA's headquarters um, down there. That was really awesome, guys. I do apologize to you guys that uh, I guess I didn't record too much, especially inside of the EA headquarters. Um, if you guys want to go like a full out tour, um, go ahead and check out the vlog I did, I think like almost two years ago. I'll leave a link in the description, guys. Um, but yeah, I did a whole tour. This time I didn't do the tour because I wanted to do a lot of one on one talk um, with the devs, tell them about the feedback that you guys gave me in the comments of course um uh, but the vlog was pretty fun i wish i could have got some more like i said time lapse shots i tried to do something to the pearson airport but you guys saw when i was walking around uh going there my the side of the airport that i was at it was just dead no one was there so i'm like i can't get no time lapse shot it's exactly like a still photo and that was the exact same problem with the hotel room the view was absolutely phenomenal um, but I couldn't get like like birds like flying or like I don't know people riding their boats and stuff none of that was happening so I was like kind of disappointed about that uh, but that being said guys I really want to say thank you guys for watching the vlog hope you guys enjoyed it I guess we had a lot of fun down at um, the EA headquarters I got to meet a bunch of the devs that I've never met before especially for like FIFA mobile I play a lot of Star Wars Galaxy of Heroes guys and I got to geek out with the I guess I guess the devs for that game that was really awesome talk to need for speed guys as well um, but yeah guys I really want to say thank you guys so much for watching i gave all the feedback that i could um to of course the developers so um yeah guys i really want to say thank you guys so much want to say another big thanks to ea sports uh, but yeah guys i'll catch you guys soon peace What's up?